How's it going fellas? Following my previous video about Leaky Moly injector and glow plug dismantling aid. In today's video I'm going to try to remove the snapped in half glow plug. First by using uh, locking pliers and a slight hammer. And if that fails I will use my professional glow plug removal tool. And after several unsuccessful efforts with the slide hammer, it seems that I'll have to use the specialized glow plug removal tool. First, using the locking pliers, I will remove the central electrode of the glow plug. This is what it looks like. You can see the jaw marks from the locking pliers. Before tapping a thread inside the stem of the glow plug, I will use this specialized drill bit to enlarge a little bit the hole in the stem. Next, using a magnetic pickup tool, carefully remove any debris left from the drilling. Continuing with the manual tap, Pay attention to align it with the central axis of the glow plug. Then proceed with the cutting of the thread by doing one revolution forward and a half revolution backwards. It's advisable to add some oil when doing so. Here you can see that the whole cutting area of the manual tap is inside the glow plug. Our cutting job is over. Using the magnetic pickup tool and a really small Allen key, carefully remove the debris from the newly threaded hole. This is the central part of the extraction tool when inserted inside the glow plug. And this is how the whole extraction assembly looks like. So let's proceed and see how it goes. Unfortunately, the glow plug snapped again and I've managed to extract only part of it. This is what's remaining and it seems that I'll have to do a second attempt with the glow plug removal tool. A second thread is cut inside the stem of the glow plug. Let's see how it goes this time.
and for this sheet again it snapped in half. Of course I won't give up, let's see what happens on the third attempt. Well, fellas, this is how success looks like a sheety glow plug covered in carbon deposits. In the end, I might use some duct tape to reassemble the glow plug. After all, I have all parts available. I have to admit that after the second unsuccessful attempt, I had some doubts whether this professional glow plug removal tool will do its job, but you saw it, it's working. Unfortunately, it's not suitable for all cars, even on mine, due to the location of the glow plugs. The two extraction extensions got a little bit curved. Additionally, you have to be prepared with a really long 5mm drill bit. There are two inside the set, but they are too short and won't help you if you manage to snap the glow plug too deeply. Finally, when placing the new glow plug, it's advisable to grease it. I will be using this ceramic grease, rated up to 1400 degrees Celsius. That's it guys, this is how to remove a snapped in half glow plug and probably lose a couple of days of your life.